In this video, I'm going to show you how to connect your PS5 controller to your computer and also how to use it to play Fortnite. So the very first thing you need to do is just click on the Windows icon from the taskbar. You can then search for settings and click on the settings window. In the left hand side, select Bluetooth and devices and make sure your Bluetooth here is turned on and enabled and then press add device. Now before you click on Bluetooth, we need to make sure the controller is in Bluetooth pairing mode. So just grab your PS5 controller and hold down the PlayStation button in the middle and also the share button in the top left hand side and you need to hold these buttons down at the same time for around about five seconds. So we're going to continue to hold these buttons down until you see a blinking blue light on your controller. Now once you see this it means the controller is in pairing mode and then we can just go and press Bluetooth from our computer. Now you should see your wireless controller appear and we can just go and select it from the list and that should automatically connect to the controller. Now if it doesn't work the first time then you can always just come back to add device and you can try repairing it in order to fix that issue. So just make sure your controller is turned on and it should say connected from here. Once you've done that you can open up the Epic Games Launcher and then you can just go and load up Fortnite on your computer. Now once you're in Fortnite click on your profile icon in the top right hand side and then you need to come down to settings. You can then click on controller from the top navigation and here's where you can go and customize all of your different controller settings. You can also click on the controller remapping and for the controller platform you need to go and change this to PlayStation 5 and then you have the option to remap all of the keys on your controller and once you've done this you can just go and apply to save the changes and it's really as simple as that guys let me know in the comments if you found this video helpful.